Ladies and gentlemen, we have just landed at Tagbilara and Bohol International Airport. Team Magleg Airlines welcomes you to the Tagbilara City. On behalf of our flight tech crew headed by Captain Kompok and the rest of the team, we thank you for choosing Team Maglayag, your airline of choice. Hello and good morning to you, my dear tourists. I'm Princess Ayn Kompok, your tour guide for this moment. I know most of you are so excited because today is the perfect time for our tour. On behalf of Gecko Tours and Travel Agency, I'd like to welcome you all to the Port of San Vicente Ferrer, or commonly known as Punta Cruz Watchtower in Maribohok, Bohol, Philippines. Did you know that Maribohok was a fishing village when Jesuit priest Juan de Torres and Gabriel Sanchez landed in Baclayon in 1595, bringing the Catholicism also in Maribohok? Father Francisco Colin, an early Jesuit historian, listed the town's name as Malabok and later changed it to Malaboho. Port St. Ver was also known as Punta Cruz. The word Punta Cruz was coined from the word cruz meaning cross, which was planted on the watchtower to scare the marauders. It was a part of a wider defense net built along the Sasayan coast to protect local settlers from approaching invaders such as Moro or Muslim. Pirates who at the time were a threat to the people of Bohol. So what are you waiting for? Let's know more about the Punta Cruz. Today is the day to turn back in time and delve into the rich history of our most prestigious heritage, Punta Cruz. What really is it? Story. The Maribohok Parish, officially known as Parroquia de Santa Cruz, was founded in 1767. When Jesuits left Maribohok, Maribohok was one of the nine big villages founded by the Augustinian Recollect Friars when they took after in 1768, they laid the foundation of the Maribohok Church in 1798 on what was once swampy land and it was finished in 1816 after 18 years of work. At the back of the church is a flight of stone stairs built in 1864. Earlier in 1796, the Punta Cruz Watchtower was built as a lookout against marauding pirates. The town of Maribohok was officially incorporated on October 15, 1860 and grew into a thriving town with a population of 18,200 in 1870. Maribohok was severely affected by the magnitude of 7.2 earthquake which strewed Bohol, suffering 16 fatalities and damage to some 3,700 homes as well as total destruction of Catholic Church. And that we can all see how Punta Cruz can be so amazing. So that's it, guys. Princess, I am your tour guide for today. And see you all to the next trip. Goodbye.